I think this, the, the, the piece is um, definitely contemporary. It's got, it's got the tonality of contemporary music. And uh, for me personally, yes, I've, I haven't done much contemporary music before. And uh, it's, been, it's been great to, to sort of get to know it. I think I was quite nervous when I started learning it. Um, I was worried I wouldn't be able to uh, learn it. It's, it's so, so different. Uh, in tonality, but actually, when once you get inside the music, uh, it makes great sense, and uh, you know you learn to you know you get to really enjoy the the music, and uh, and now listening to Alan, who's the tenor, I'm you know getting to know his pieces too, and uh, getting to uh, enjoy them and in all their. The most difficult thing is the fact that there's so many there's so many different styles in the piece, so many different languages. So you have to be able to switch quickly in your mind and your voice. When the music's quite spreshed dimmer and you're having to speak a lot, um, it's, it can be uh, quite difficult to remember, you know, actually what you're, what you're saying because it's so prescriptive the way that you say each word. He's, he's written down every little syllable. And so sometimes uh, the way he does it is, is, is you're, you're a lot more of an instrument than um, a, a classical sort of performer like, a, like an opera singer would be. You're used just like any other instrument. Um, but in other pieces, it's absolutely, you have to, you have to speak through the text. You know, you, that's, that's your vehicle and you have to make it make sense. I think obviously for me it's easy when it's in English to do that, but I have to try, try to do it just as well in, in uh, Spanish, Italian or German as well, so that's the challenge. Yeah, some of it is modern, some of it is like popular music, so it's modern but popular. Some of it is very avant-garde, but not all of it. Uh, voices by Hansa is uh, is difficult to describe as a whole because all the songs are so very different. Uh, there are some which uh, owe something to the sort of German cabaret style, um, and then there are others that are that are like Schubert lead, and then others again that are um, like uh, Italian songs. But they're they're all so unique and special. Um, that you know, it's been really interesting getting to know them. It's been really, you know, really difficult to, to learn them because each piece is so individual. Not not everything because nobody ever, ever likes everything, but I like I like most of it. Yeah.